Hi, all of you. A very good morning to you all, and welcome to Dental Amaze Academy. Now, in this uh, short session regarding NEET MDS entrance preparation, I'm going to tell you about two ways to prepare for MDS entrance examination, and which is the most successful way, and which is the most common way. Okay, both are different. So, these are the two ways people follow. Learn one is to learn the entire syllabus. Okay. and the second is learn what the toppers learn now this two are two different things let's look into that in depth okay now learn the entire syllabus it will take you around next 5 years trust me okay it's true okay entire syllabus is so huge it's almost impractical and you will see that this this is the most common method of people who do the self preparation okay the most common method where they do the self preparation they follow this method okay now unfortunately in fact and it starts very well you feel like okay you google everything you find everything you start reading in detail the textbook it starts very well but yes but it's not practical when it comes to the end stage of the preparation and its end results are very unsatisfying what happens is that stresses build up okay it leads to low confidence like you feel you have not done anything you have forgotten everything what you have learned your concept is not clear lots of problems and finally ending up in loss of self belief okay so this is one thing where you try to learn the entire syllabus which is not possible now now remember this is a competitive exam okay it's it doesn't decide it's not decided based based on how much marks you score it's decided based on comparative marks you have scoring like with regard to the first rank holder so or with regards to the toppers how much are you scoring okay you know the concept of percentile okay anyway i'm not going into depth of that but yes what is needed is learn what toppers learn now there is lots of questions in your mind i know so let's discuss one by one what are the steps involved in this okay what toppers learn that's one thing and what is the end result of that and finally for doing this when should you start your preparation okay so let's discuss the first part which is the steps okay so the steps are to learn what everyone learns which will include the topper definitely okay i'll tell you what to do for that and next is the topper strategy so this first one is everyone including the toppers next is specifically what the toppers do that's very very important so this one learn what everyone learns it is what dental pulse okay previous questions dental pulse or dentist okay the second thing is core topics it's just not dental pulse you have to go into a little bit of depth of that okay concept layering all those things especially in regards to the core topics okay and which is comes under 2080 rule which is called the smart learning strategy they have made already one video on that the 2080 rule okay it's very important to know the core topics is the 20 percentage so you have to master them and this is what everyone learns okay now what is next next is the topper strategy that is selectively learning some very specific topics now how do you select that how do you know that the specific topics definitely guidance is the key there and it is based on the recent pattern analysis now it's very difficult when it comes to self learning to learn this effectively people either overdo it or underdo it okay so it's very important that you have to very clearly analyze the recent pattern recent questions and you have to learn in depth of it okay very selectively so what there are certain topics we shouldn't learn okay even if it's a recent pattern question there are some areas you have to go into a little bit depth some areas which you have to go in core depth so that is depends upon the analysis okay now and guidance is the key there definitely so two areas guidance are going to come as one is core topics okay this is just your dental pulse one is core topics sec second is selective learning and third is definitely revision this is what your toppers do very effectively till you master them now what is the definition definition of mastering for mds entrance exam that's a different lecture in its all it's not what you think it's a different thing i'll tell you later on finally what happens what's the end result of learning in this way you build up confidence which is the most important thing which is the most important thing for neat mds okay better self belief yes i can do that i've done i've done my i've done it okay i've done very good and what happens your rank comes up your academy's rank list you come you come in the toppers list so there becomes a self belief okay and as a result you are end up in the actual toppers of the mds entrance examination so for this so this is an effective way of learning it isn't it the way toppers learn so for this you have to go i know that there is a lot more to explain in this regard uh, but yes to make it as short as possible i have included only the key points here yes 
when to start your preparation is a question to do this very effectively i think if i explain that in this it will become a very long lecture so in the next session i'm going to discuss when should i start my preparation so thank you so much see you in the next session bye